And my top favorite is for sure the Alang and Zuna triple split. And I'm sure that's been a fan favorite the entire fair. That's uh, for me the top complication to make a watch that can take intermediate timings up to 12 hours using three split hands. That's an amazing, comp amazing, amazing accomplishment. And it's only 43 millimeters. <laughs> I mean, something like that would normally be like in a giant box, but we're talking about something you can literally wear. So <laughs> that's pretty amazing. So that was my top one. And um, I also have to say I was incredibly impressed by the, the planetarium from Von Kleef and Arpel. 38 millimeter size. It's different from the one we saw two years ago or three years ago, uh, which was a 44 millimeter, almost unwearable planetarium on the wrist, even though it included all nine planets. The smaller one, of course, can't have all nine planets. It has three planets, but it's 38 millimeters. It's so wearable and beautiful. And the coolest thing, the Earth, as it rotates, it has a little satellite moon that rotates around the Earth. So you have the, the moon going around the Earth and the Earth going around the sun, and you can watch it 365 days a year. It is absolutely amazing. And the third one's gonna be surprising because this is not a brand I choose very often. Um, for a favorite or a top five, but I have to really take off my hat to Cartier for the Revealed Panther. And it's not even a mechanical complication, it's a playful, incredible dial animation that includes 900 solid gold beads that act like they're in an hourglass and they fall down the dial to create a panther face and then keep falling to land at the bottom of the dial every time you move your wrist. I was blown away.